Hi, this is Drew with DIY Green Energy, and tonight I'm bringing you a review of the Big Camper, my portable camping power pack that I made. It runs on two 12 volt batteries, 7 amp hours a piece. It's got a cigarette lighter port here in the front. It's got a total of 27 LEDs uh, on the fronts and sides. It's got an on off switch up here at the top and it gets pretty bright. This thing lights up about a good 270 degrees. Um, the front area here uh, will project out to about a good 100 feet. And you can use this little power pack to power almost anything you would do. Well, you know, 12 volt accessories, charge your phone, um, run a small inverter for short periods of time. Uh, okay, here are the batteries. These are two uh, 7 amp hour deep cycle 12 volt batteries. I actually recycled these out of my old uh, Razor 300 scooter. And so far these little things have been uh, trading pretty well. Um, I have a little fuse block in here. Uh, this one here is temporary until I get my uh, regular inline fuse in there. Um, I had to make custom uh, junctions so I could still utilize the original, you know, charging unit from the scooter in the 24 volt configuration and then still be able to use it for my 12 volt uh, configuration afterwards. And here's the switch again, you see it lights up pretty bright. Uh, that's my little 300 watt inverter right there, which you'll see uh, plugged into this unit here in a minute. Um, I hot glued all the wiring into place uh, for to keep everything nice and secure and all penetrations that I made through the box with the exception of this one obviously. Um, I also sealed with uh, hot glue only because I did not have any silicone on hand. Um, I would highly recommend silicone but you know you got to use what you got to use a lot of times when you're doing a do-it-yourself project. And you can see this unit is so easy to work with. You can do it with one hand. It weighs a total of about 15 pounds. So it's a little bit on the heavy side, but it works out very well. And I just plugged my inverter in, so you see there's no tricks or gimmicks. Oh, you're going to pull that when I'm shooting a video, huh? Oh, am I having a technical difficulty? Yes, I am. I will be right back. Okay, and we're back. Sorry about that. Had a slight uh, bit of technical difficulty there, but everything's running just fine now. Okay. Now you see the inverter's powered up. And for an example, uh, it's not the kind of load that you can run. Small load, grant, uh, mind you. But this is a little 100 watt LED, you know, draws about 18 watts in the equivalents. And just plug it right into your inverter and boom. You got power, household current, you know, coming out of your little camping power pack. I mean, this is good for short bursts, you know, if you get to your campsite at night. You can light up the area pretty well for about a good half hour or so until you're set up. Um, later on, I'm going to be making a expansion pack for this. That way I can double the capacity of it, making it a 28 amp hour battery bank. I just to show you the technical difficulty that I had was uh, this connection right here. Um, it's a little finicky because I don't have the right connector on there right now. I was kind of rushing to get this project done so I could take it out on my camping trip, uh, which it performed phenomenal on. I've used this unit on three different camping trips now, and it's just proven to be a champ. Um, so I'm really thinking about starting uh, a uh, Kickstarter 
to try to market this for other campers as well as uh, people who live in areas that, you know, run out of power and whatnot, emergency situations and whatnot. It'd be a nice little um, portable peace of mind, as I would call it, to keep with you. Oh well, yeah, please uh, leave your comments in the comments section. Any questions, um, you know, general shit. Uh, I will get back to you as soon as I can. If you like this video, please like it, share it, and be rem uh, be remember. Please remember to subscribe. Sorry, it's 5:31 in the morning here, and I just got home not too long ago and decided to shoot a video. Cause, yeah, why not? Eventually, I'm going to put a solar charge controller in here and uh, another port on here f to hook up a solar panel to it. So when I'm out on my two, three day camping trips, I can recharge this during the daytime as the sun is running. Uh, uh, stay tuned for part two. But I'm going to show you the voltage draws after I get that video set up. Thank you. Have a good day.